All right, Amber, you know, developing right now, as you maybe head out for Black Friday shopping this week, you may be looking for more than gifts, things like furniture, or maybe a new TV, one of those big 100 inches, right? But those things are part of the Consumer Product Safety Commission's push to prevent tip overs in your home. It's an important thing to know. I know dressers, it was a big deal years ago about this. Joining us now, uh, talking about the Anchor It campaign, Carla Crosswhite. Carla, thanks for joining us. This is uh, Stefano DiPietro Antonio with you here in Cincinnati. Uh, furniture tip overs really impact our very youngest and our oldest, our senior citizens more than anyone, right? Hi, Steffi. Yes, and thanks for having me to talk about this important issue. As you mentioned, it's the holiday time. Families will be gathering in homes. There'll be lots of children around, perhaps, and even older adults, as you mentioned. And yes, these are the demographics that are uh, affected more than any others um, uh, due to tip over incidents. So we like to take this time as people are going out, spending uh, money on getting these good deals for products and particularly for furniture and TVs, as you mentioned, to remind them to make sure you anchor those items securely to the wall. You know, unsecured TVs, furniture, and even appliances um, are hidden hazards in the home. And a lot of people just aren't aware um, of the dangers of, of this um, problem. Yes, uh, our producer Brad was reminding me as I was trying to set up our Christmas tree on top of a ladder in the newsroom just a little while ago that uh, you might want to anchor that thing down so it doesn't fall and take somebody out. Uh, where can we get these uh, anchors? Uh, are, is it a, a standard size that you get somewhere? And how do we know if they're installed correctly? Uh, great questions. Um, so f the good news is manufacturers are really um, starting to include anchors in the furniture when you purchase uh, either TVs or furniture. So that's the good news. And as a matter of fact, for uh, store clothing storage units like dressers and amours and that sort of thing, it's actually federal law now that they must include an anchoring kit um, with the product. But if not, um, you can order them online. They're very, it's very easy to do that or just go to your local hardware store um, to, to pick up one. They're usually less than $20. And fairly easily easy to install. It takes about 20 minutes. You can go to our website, anchorit.gov. We have how-to videos to show consumers exactly how to anchor furniture and TV safely. Also, Carla, I would think that uh, when you get maybe your new TV, that big 100-incher, even though they're a lot lighter now than they were, still if you're putting something that wide and that tall on maybe a smaller uh, credenza or something, uh, it may not have the, the base weight to make it something steady. Your child tries to reach up and look at something on top and suddenly everything comes toppling down. Exactly. I mean, you got it. Um, you know, um, most people do mount their TVs to the wall these days, but there's still a lot of people, as you said, that actually place a freestanding TV on top of a piece of furniture. Um, for some reason, if you're not able to anchor that, um, the best thing is to do is to push it back as far as possible to the wall. Make sure there are no cords hanging or dangling where somebody can grab on and pull pull that down. Um, also, too, it's very important not to put things that are tempting to children um, on furniture because, you, as you know, children love to climb and um, reach for things. So if they see their toys or, you know, the remote control or their juice box or something on top of the furniture, um, you know, they would be tempted to, to grab that. And that could be a potential danger of pulling that thing over. Also, too, another uh, tip is to put heavier items on on lower levels of your of your dressers to keep that stability um, um, for your furniture. Carla Crosswhite with the Consumer Product Safety Commission. Great to have you on. Some great advice right there. And I uh, hope you guys have a Merry Christmas and a safe one as well. As you too. And thanks again for having me to discuss this. Happy holidays. Thank you. Same to you.